Welcome to another episode of SQL Server Tutorial. Today I will be talking about Linked Server and how to query Oracle Database from SQL Server Management Studio. What is Linked Server? Linked servers are configured to enable the database engine to execute the transact SQL statement that includes tables in another instance of SQL Server, or another database product such as Oracle. Many types of LADB data sources can be configured as linked servers, including Microsoft Access and Excel. Linked servers offer the following advantages. The ability to access data from outside of SQL Server. The ability to issue distributed queries, updates, commands, and transactions on heterogeneous data sources across the enterprise. The ability to address diverse data sources similarly. Now I am going to show you how to configure SQL Server to establish link with an Oracle database. Oracle Linked Server require OLADB provider. An OLADB provider is a DLL that manages and interacts with a specific data source. If your Oracle database is not in same server then you have to install the Oracle Data Access Components, ODC, for Windows consists of Oracle client-side drivers. ODAC is freely available at Oracle site. Now we are ready to configure Link Server. Open SQL Server Management Studio. Under Server Objects you will find Link Servers. Right click on Link Servers and select New Link Server. In General section type any suitable name. Select Oracle Provider for OLADB. Type any product name suppose Oracle. Now type data source name of your SQL Server. It is usually a combination of Oracle Server IP colon port number slash TNS listener name. Then go to Security tab. Select Be Made using this security context. Type database username and password. After that go to Server Options. Change our PC out to True. Click OK to complete configuration. Finally test it. OK. Now we are going to use Open Query to retrieve data for linked server. Open New Query Editor in SQL Server Management Studio. Type following code to get data for buyer table. You can use Design Query Editor also, to make complex query. That's all for today. Please do comment for any clarification and don't forget to subscribe my channel.